Somerset is located in south central Kentucky, 76 miles south of Lexington on the northeastern edge of Lake Cumberland in Pulaski County. Somerset is ideally situated within 600 miles of half of the entire population of the United States. Residents enjoy four full seasons with relatively mild winters averaging only 12 to 13 inches of snowfall annually. Although rapidly securing its position as the medical, technical, and industrial center for southern Kentucky, Somerset and Pulaski County have retained the benefits of small town living and simple American values that make this an ideal place to live, work, and to raise a family. Thanks in large part to its proximity to Lake Cumberland and its resort lifestyle, Somerset is a popular retirement destination for seniors from many states. Lake Cumberland is the fifth largest man-made lake in the United States, drawing 7 million visitors annually. There are 13 colleges and universities within 60 miles of Somerset, featuring an enrollment of 32,600 students. Over the past decade, Somerset and Pulaski County have added thousands of new jobs to the local economy. Key factors include Kentucky's low energy costs and low expense of doing business. Add Somerset's convenient geographic location and it becomes apparent why Somerset is increasingly becoming a popular location for new industry. Our home office is in Los Angeles, California and out in California they're not very pro-business. Here in Kentucky you have a very fair and controlled workers' comp system. Uh, your energy costs are, are very minimal and we found in the Pulaski Somerset region that there is plenty of available workers. We've done an analysis and moving here to the Somerset area will save the company over a million dollars a year. Between workers comp saving, energy costs, and finally uh, reduced freight charges to, to our customers. I absolutely love the area. Uh, outstanding quality of life. For, for the lake and for me personally, I'm a golfer. There's a lot of great golf courses. We have really loved our uh, time here in Somerset. I'm really excited about the possibility of getting a commuter airlines here in Somerset. Uh, our home office is in Los Angeles. I many times have to fly there. I have to drive all the way up to Lexington and then get on a plane and spend the day flying across the country. Uh, the added savings of being able to just come right into Somerset for both me and, and the staff that is going back and forth to California is, is, is really exciting to me. Uh, I can very easily say that we would have a, a great deal of use for a good commuter uh, or charter service coming in. For our own people uh, commuting to the, the major markets in the country that we serve and also for the ease of bringing in the customer base into our facility to show them what a great facility we will have. Somerset and Pulaski County not only offers a great business climate, but it also provides an excellent environment for people to live and actually raise their families. Our company is a stamping and fabricator of metal parts for the Toyota North America operation. We provide stampings and welded parts to Toyota, not only here in the United States, but also in Canada. We started our business approximately seven years ago. Since that time, we have actually grown from 30 employees up to 800 at the present time. We are looking forward for further expansion and opportunity to even grow more here within the community. We have approximately 50 people flying each month either domestically or internationally. There are other businesses in the community, not only in Somerset, but surrounding areas of Burnside, Monticello, Science Hill, that also have businesses that have a great need to have the service provided, which will give us direct access to airport hubs. I believe that if anyone would come to Somerset with an air carrier service, that it would prove to be very successful as it is a much needed service. Uh, we have about a uh, thousand employees in the organization in Kentucky and Florida and uh, we've used uh, our private aircraft uh, services uh, for the last decade, decade, decade and a half building our organization uh, throughout the southeast. Uh, I believe truly that uh, having a commercial aircraft service here in the Somerset Lake Cumberland area would benefit our organization greatly. It certainly would lower our 
cost of doing business uh, outside of uh, this particular section of Kentucky and would enable us to have a reasonably priced uh, commuter service and transportation service um, throughout the United States and worldwide. We also have a, a, an office, a, a very nice office in Mexico City, which uh, all of our offices in Florida and in our international office in Mexico City requires uh, some type of uh, aircraft service. So commercial air service would be very beneficial to, our, to the Lifelong Health Group. It is estimated that a commercial air service at Somerset Pulaski County Airport will draw passengers from a primary market area of five Kentucky counties with a population exceeding 145,000. Uh, Lake Cumberland here has 1,255 miles of shoreline and uh, we have over seven million tourists a year visit our lake. Uh, these tourists are not only from adjoining states, the next ten states that join us, but also from over 40 states across America. And we've also this past year had people from out of the country uh, just come in to see the scenery and learn about our lake and several local attractions that we have. There's no doubt in my mind that with our community and what is offered here, that a commuter air service will be very profitable here. It will benefit both parties well. We're having people move here from California. They're moving here from Ohio. Um, we're talking about industries moving here, so they will need to be traveling. They, those people will need to be moved from one point to another. And that's one reason we're working so hard to get a commuter service here in this area. It's, we think that we could be a valuable customer to a commuter air service, and it would also be a valuable asset for us to have in our community to create new industries and to uh, recruit them here in our community. We are located at the hub of a non-served area. We are located in a place where economic development is always occurring. We are located in an area where people need on a daily basis and not just once a day, but several times each day to get to and from the airline hubs or to and from the areas where other economic activity is going on. In our area, we now have to drive to Lexington, Louisville, Cincinnati, or Nashville in order to pick up regular scheduled um, airplane flights. There's no question in my mind that this community will support a commuter air service. In fact, I believe that a commuter air service would be surprised by the ridership that would occur within the first six months, that they would be looking at the problem of putting on more aircraft rather than the problem of, of trying to fill up the aircraft that exists. It's very important to our community because it'll help us get the industry. It's very important to the airport because the airport's going to thrive. They're going to have good business not only from business, but from local people who will get in the system and they won't have to worry about getting out, being screened in Lexington, Louisville, Nashville, Greater Cincinnati. They'll do it here, they'll be in the system, and they will fly to their destination, and they're going to love it. The Somerset Pulaski County area is known as the houseboat capital of the world. There's approximately seven to eight manufacturers located in this tri-county region. Uh, I think with the commuter air service, it would be very important to bring in not only the clientele that purchase our houseboats, but the vendors that sell us our product as well. Uh, Lake Cumberland Regional Hospital is a uh, vibrant regional medical community. Many of the services we provide, we provide for our entire region of uh, over 150,000 people. And for some of the services we provide, our, our service area is much larger. We provide services for three to 500,000 people. We're committed to becoming the best regional hospital in the state of Kentucky. Uh, because of that strong commitment, uh, we have made a commitment to bringing in the best healthcare professionals, the best doctors, the best technicians in addition to training the ones that we have in the best way that we can. That requires a, uh, access to some of the best health care resources in other medical communities for networking purposes, educational purposes, and, and the ability to bring people in here. Just this past, um, this past several months we've been bringing doctors from everywhere from New York to California into our medical community, uh, usually flying them into Lexington and sometimes Knoxville. Uh, flying our staff out to conferences in Arizona, Florida. Uh, so the, the need is, is daily. We're part of a corporation our, ourselves based in Tennessee and we're uh, constantly going to our corporate offices and going out to meetings. Somerset Pulaski County affords companies a lot of uh, opportunity to grow and prosper. 
Uh, if you look around the community, you see a lot of uh, both the uh, existing industry you would see in a community, but also you see tourism, retail, healthcare, a number of areas that we're growing. In terms of attracting a uh, traditional air carrier, uh, those companies are going to benefit from this growth and prosperity. We're not just limited to one particular uh, sector of the economy growing. Uh, I think when a company comes in here, uh, so, uh, whether it be an air, airline carrier, a uh, small business, or an industry, they see the growth and vitality of the community, and they grow with the community. And I think that's where the uh, long term, uh, the companies will come in, uh, they'll test the markets, uh, make small investments, or maybe a large investment, depending on, on the company. Uh, but once they've made a decision to locate in Somerset and Pulaski County, uh, we've seen a, a great deal of growth from existing businesses. And I think it will be the same for airline industry. Once they make that commitment, they locate here, uh, they see that that ridership is there, they see the support of the business community, they see the, see the support of the community at large, they'll grow and develop with this community. It would be wonderful for our faculty and staff who often have to drive to Lexington and pay for overnight parking to attend conferences or workshops in other places flying out of Lexington. It would also be a great benefit for any speakers that we would have come into Somerset or any candidates for interviewing and for positions. We would make a great deal of use of a local airport, I believe. In addition, we have a very fine aviation maintenance program. It is the only one in the state, and our students here have to go elsewhere to have employment because there's not a lot of reason for them to stay in Somerset, but ours is fully accredited by FAA and I think this might offer some employment opportunities and certainly some partnership opportunities between our aviation maintenance program and a commuter air service. The work you see over my shoulder here is the earthwork that's being done for the terminal and also the hangar and we're building this anticipating a commuter air service. I don't care where you go in the United States, you won't find an area that's any more ready for commuter air service than Somerset and Pulaski County. We have done our homework, we know that it's there, or we would not be participating in this project. We do not want something in Pulaski County that will fail. We want something that's a good marriage for both companies, otherwise it's no good for either one. Over $10 million have been invested in improvements to the Somerset-Pulaski County Airport in order to make the airport ready for commercial air service. These improvements include a brand new commuter air terminal building, maintenance hangar, and apron area. They also include the relocation of Kit Cowan Road to allow for the expansion of the runway to 6,000 feet with a new precision ILS approach and improved lighting system to accommodate regional jet traffic. These improvements and significant financial investment represent Somerset-Pulaski County's extraordinary commitment to becoming the region's business and transportation hub. Over the last three years, we've secured $10 million for this airport, including uh, in for the uh, runway extensions uh, and paving and the uh, ILS system and now this beautiful new terminal and uh, hangar building. Uh, so we've been behind this project from day one and we'll see it through to completion. Another key to the importance and viability of commuter air service at the Somerset-Pulaski County Airport is the construction of the first leg of Interstate 66, which will connect I-75 and I-65. This vital transportation corridor will serve to enhance access for a wider range of passengers wishing to utilize the airport. From a practical standpoint, we're long overdue for commuter air service. And there's no doubt in my mind that this community will support the airline. We have great recreational attraction with the lake and the golf courses. We have world-class medical center. We have some of the most advanced infrastructure in the nation for our business and industry. You're the final piece in our puzzle. We need you to help us make Somerset Pulaski County a world-class community.